Well, I just got in the mood to do a little bit of VBT monitoring. I have an existing power in POP100 profile. I went through a range of loads, established where my peak power is occurring or close to it. It's right about 145 pounds. And I just kind of felt like today to put 145 on the bar, do a couple reps after a little warm up I just did to see where my peak power is and really want to see where my POP100 is. That's my explosiveness, my ability to generate velocity early in the range of motion. And so to know how impulsive this is, I'm doing it in some jeans, what the heck. So I've got the Move Factor X on the barbell here, synced up to the Move Factor X Sport Mobile application. We've got POP 100 velocity. That is the velocity at the 100 millisecond point of the concentric phase. So look at it as early velocity, that explosive strength aspect. We've got peak power, full range of motion, depth. I like to look at that just as kind of a spot check. I'm interested in hitting between like 20 and 22 inches. And then down here in the bar graph, we've got peak velocity we'll show, which will show the um, eccentric phase along with the concentric phase. That's interesting information as well, but we're not gonna go in that to that today. The goal here today is for me to do a very basic monitoring protocol where I'm gonna go back at a repeatable number of value I've selected 145 pounds and see what my peak power output looks like and what my POP 100 looks like. So let me get this going. Excuse my mug as I come in here to pull the bar. And I'm gonna fire off two repetitions. Okay, now I've got some data to review. I'll come back to you on that. 